Hi, I'm Patty Jackson. I'm your auntie of pop culture, and there is so much going on for an MLK weekend. Let's talk movies. You gotta see Bad Boys for Life. Many wondered after 25 years, would the magic still be there? Of course it's there. Will Smith, Martin Lawrence, it's funny. It's action, the buddy movie. Wait until you see both of them. I love the action scenes, but you know what I loved? This kind of like rebirth of Martin Lawrence. It's funny, you're gonna love it. There's lots of eye candy, ladies. But it's a great movie, Bad Boys for Life. It's in theaters now. Another movie that's drawing importance is Just Mercy. It's the story of a young lawyer, Brian Stevenson, who fought to get a man off of death row. These characters being played by Michael B. Jordan and Jamie Foxx. Brie Larson also stars. Jamie Foxx really immerses himself in the role. And what they're doing with the big promotional push this weekend is to get people to see a true story, a great story, for an MLK weekend. Just Mercy, Michael B. Jordan, Jamie Foxx, Brie Larson. It's in theaters now. So, there are some big honors coming up. Let's talk about the Rock and Roll Hall of Fame. Whitney Houston and the Notorious B.I.G. have made the cut in ceremonies that are taking place May 2nd. Another big honor, Mariah Carey and the Isley Brothers are both being inducted into the Songwriters Hall of Fame, which is taking place in June. We get caught up in all the glitz with Mariah Carey, but she's written a lot of songs, including All I Want for Christmas is You. Now take a band like the Isley Brothers who have been around for decades. They're great music, they're great songs. This is a great honor for the fabulous Isley Brothers. Next weekend, it's the Grammy Awards. Alicia Keys is gonna be hosting, and let me tell you about some of the people that are gonna be performing. Ariana Grande's been added to the cast, as well as Uncle Charlie, Charlie Wilson. There are gonna be two tributes taking place during the Grammys, and one is going out to rapper Nipsey Hussle. We don't know quite yet, they're keeping it under wraps, but they're doing a tribute to him. And of course, Prince's Let's Go Crazy. A lot of you are wondering, where's Mars Day in the Time? Mars Day in the Time has been included in this tribute to Prince, as well as the Foo Fighters, Chris Martin, Coldplay, Earth, Wind & Fire, Jam & Lewis, Sheila E., Usher, Alicia Keys, who's not only hosting the Grammys, but she's taking place in the Prince Tribute as well. It's called Let's Go Crazy. This year's Grammy Awards, it's all about the music. Ava DuVernay is back around Valentine's Day with an exciting project entitled Cherish the Day. It's a celebration of black love. It looks amazing. It's going to be an eight-part series that's debuting on the OWN Network February the 11th. Kudos to Ava DuVernay. Cherish the Day, coming to OWN in February. Tyler Perry, he's tackling everything, and right now, it's Netflix. What are you doing this weekend? His latest fall from grace is streaming this weekend on Netflix. He's got Felicia Rashad, he's got Cicely Tyson, he's got newcomer Crystal Fox. The ending, you can't figure it out. And yes, it's gonna blow you away. It's an exciting new project for Tyler Perry, who is ready to take over Netflix. If you have a business, you want people to know about it. It's no sense in having a business and no one knows about it. You want to shout it to the top of the roofs, and here's how you can do it. All the info is at the bottom of the screen. I would love to give your business a shout out. Very affordable price, your business. You want people to know about it. Let me give you a shout out. All the information is at the bottom of the screen. We get thousands of views on a weekly basis. You're probably saying, well, Patty, why should you give us a shout out? The thousands of views, you want your business put in front of it. All the info is at the bottom of the screen.